One special team is learning how to overcome obstacles to reach their goal. I think that my hope and my teammates hope for this season is we had the goal of getting back to that district championship and winning that district championship. Last year we fell short to Staley um, for the first time after a four-peat and that was heartbreaking especially for the upperclassmen who've ha experienced a lot of those games and championships from that four-peat. As the Park Hill Lady Children's have been waiting all year to get back on the field, they are faced with the unordinary. Coronavirus has changed the season in a lot of ways. The biggest one being that we haven't had one. We haven't played any of our planned or scheduled games. So the biggest thing for us is we hope that we can play some game, maybe a senior night, <laughs> before um, season is over and school is over for, for good. In order to get into the soccer spirit, these athletes have turned to one useful platform. So, so our social media has been more active than it ever has. So Olivia Noble posted that she had ran six miles and hashtagged it with C6Do6. And then I saw it and I thought, well, hey, now it's my turn. So I ran the six miles and then posted and jokingly tagged two of my teammates. Then Avery did it and she tagged two more people and then it kind of took off. But I think the reason that this challenge has been so popular, especially on our team, is because it feels like we're together even when we're not. In these tough times for a spring sport athlete, Grace never forgets to keep in mind that no matter how many minutes we play on the field, we will always be the 2020 varsity squad, and that will never change. No one could have said it better. Reporting for Trojan TV News, I'm Salma Yimmer, alongside Sam Burton Sino.